Welcome back everybody. Now today I've got something a little bit different. It's not really a product review. These are a couple of time wasters for those of you who are at home and need something to break up the monotony. Now I'm kind of breaking my normal rule that I don't usually do gross items. Like I've refused for years to do those wax removers. These aren't real biological gross items, so I figure I can break my rule a little bit. But what I've got today is the Poppet Pal, which are simulated pimples that you can pop and the Chef Slime Emoji Slime Squeezer. These are definitely a couple of gross diversions for those of you who need something to fill your day. So let's take a look in today's video. Let's take a look first at Chef Slime. Believe it or not, this one was being advertised on Instagram and I had a few requests for it. I, the advertising was kind of strange. To me, it just looks like an emoji with slime in it, but maybe there's something more to it. So it looks like you got packets of slime and your em emoji with, with a mouth. Oh, there's a lot of packets. Please tell me there's instructions. You know, I know I can figure this stuff out, but I do like to follow the instructions so I make sure I'm doing everything right. Because you know how it is in YouTube. You do anything not according to instructions, you get raked over the coals. Oh, there are instructions. Let the liquid in the egg solidify for a few minutes before squeezing it out. And that's it. Th that's the instructions? I'm gonna get rid of this covering here. Voila. Okay, well, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna open one. One packet. I think I'm gonna put the green in the, in the pink. Oh, that's slimy. That's, that's definitely slimy. It feels pretty slimy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, this better not stain my table, man. It's more liquidy than, than other slimes that I've touched. It's very liquidy, look at that. It feels like liquid. Of course, I'm no slime connoisseur, so that maybe this is commonplace. I guess I just shove it in the emoji's mouth. Oh, you can like suck it in there. Oh. Oh, that's making all kinds of sounds. I don't think I'm making any progress. Do I just shove it in there? What do I do? I'm, oh, I am making progress. If I push it slowly open and then just let go real fast. Oh, it's in. Oh, it's in. All right, so while that one solidifies, I'm gonna try a second one and maybe try both of them at the same time. Just to satisfy my OCD friends out there, I will do yellow and yellow. All right, once again, very liquidy slime. Oh, 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 it just it like slurped all the slime right in there. That was like amazing and gross at the same time. I gotta try another one now. Maybe I'm getting the hang of this. All right. I was just gonna do two. I'm doing all of them now. I'm, now I'm getting into it. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, I did it. That was so cool. After the first one, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm kind of enjoying this now. All right, we're going for number four. You know, when I saw this, I thought it was a pretty, kind of, maybe a dumb idea. But now that I've actually done it in person, I'm actually kind of thinking it's not such a bad idea because there's something oddly satisfying about this. It's gonna dangle over the mouth there. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, <laughs> why is that so oddly satisfying? I'm just not sure. They were kind of showing it, spitting the slime out and slurping it back up, so to speak. Let's see here. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, 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 that's just so wrong and so right at the same time. Blech. There must be experts at this and I'm, I'm no expert. I'm just, a, I'm just a beginner. Let me try another one. And. <laughs> oh, oh, that's, oh, oh, oh. You know, I'm having way more fun with this than I sh probably should and than I ever expected. You could even have like your own uh, performance here. Hey, what'd you think about that linguine and clam sauce? I didn't really like it. <laughs> All right, I've had enough. That's it, I'm done. I'm done. But I will say that Chef Slime, to me, is a surprising hit. Look at that. Oh. Hey, wipe your mouth off, boy. Blah. Mm. 
Oh, all right. I think I'm, I think I'm done with chef slime for the day, but surprisingly, I think I'm not done with it forever. Cause I might actually pull this out when I'm extremely bored because who would want to do this? I mean, somebody would want to, and I think I'm that somebody. Let's take a look at pop it pal, which is supposed to be simulated pimple popping. This is not normally something I would do because I find the whole idea of it pretty gross. But the only reason I'm getting away with this, even in my own mind, is because I know this is not real. This is just simulated, so it's it's not quite as gross as the real thing. So I think I can probably handle this one. I'm going against my usual rule of not doing gross items. The only reason I'm doing this one is because it's not actually real. It's just simulated slime, so it's not, in my mind, it's not a biological grossness. It's just texture. So uh, let's crack this open and see what it's like. Some people would love this. Some people like me. Not so much, but let's see it. Maybe I'll change my mind when I use it though. It says pop it pal comes ready to pop immediately out of the box. There's no assembly in required. This is what it looks like. It's kind of almost skin like, so I can see how they did that. And I guess each one of these would be the repository for the fake pimple material. So they have a refill, which you can fill this up again after you've emptied all the existing zits that are pre-filled. There aren't really instructions with it. It just says to squeeze. Let's, so let's try. Here we go. I'm almost nervous. Oh, 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 look at that. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of like pasty and cheesy. It definitely smells like a chemical and not something biological. If that makes it less gross for you. Son, wipe that off your face. All right, let's try some more. I'm gonna get into this now. Oh, oh, that's a good one. Oh, that was more like a sebaceous cyst than a pimple. Oh, it squirted out. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this is so wrong on so many levels. Why would people enjoy this? I'm, I'm laughing at myself for even doing this. I'm not sure what that material, what's that? What's this stuff made out of? Does it even say? All right, the ingredients are just canola oil and beeswax, so it doesn't look like it's anything too unsafe. That's, that's a good thing. Ooh. Oh, and it, oh. Oh, man. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get all of them. I'm doing all of them. <laughs> oh, it's like all over my hands. Oh, look at that, come on now. I guess you could give this to your, uh, your preteen for before they become a teenager and they have practice at it. I don't know. That's the only practical use I can think about for it. Let me see how this refill works. Oh, my hands are all greasy now. I can't even open that up. I gotta go wash my hands. I guess you just place it in there and squeeze. How do you know when it's full? If I hold up the light, I can kind of see through it. I guess that's when you know it's full and it starts overflowing. Okay, well, I guess that's... That's one way of doing it. I have no idea if I'm doing this right or not. Are there people out there that actually do this so much that there's, that there are pros at this? This would be kind of a cool gift to give someone, especially if you have a friend who likes that Dr. Pimple Popper show, this would be something to give them as a gag gift. And they'd probably actually enjoy it too. If they like a show like that, they'd probably enjoy something like this. I'm honestly not sure if I filled that up correctly. Let me, let me try a few squeezes and see what happens. Oh yeah. Oh, there it goes again. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> that one launched out of there. All right. I think I'm tapping out. I'm tapping out now. I'm tapping out. I'm done. Uh, it's very greasy. It's, it's definitely greasy and you don't get as much use out of that. Maybe it's something like this where you can do it over and over again between the pre-filled pop it pal and the refill. You're not going to get a lot of use out of this. I think there are, there is a segment of society that will enjoy this, especially nowadays kind of being in quarantine when you don't have much to do, this might be a time killer for you as is this. So there you have it. I don't know if anybody is interested in these or not, but I've actually seen this one advertised on social media. So there's out, people out there who actually like this kind of thing, but if you try to pop it pal or the chef slime emoji, tell me what you think in the comments below. Please follow my social profiles for progress pictures videos as I go. And please subscribe for more product reviews from me, James White with Freaking Reviews. Oh, oh.